For a young writer, the dream of having a published book may seem like a long shot. The cost and resources to bring it to print are unrealistic for most teenagers. One Twin Cities boy wanted to change that by creating a publishing company that's specifically designed to help young authors. Rachel Slavic has the story behind Sigma's bookshelf. Every writer has moments when the words just don't flow freely. For Justin Anderson, the solution is simple. Uh, where are you? His mom, Rachel, helps overcome writer's block. Her background in publishing gives her a keen eye. What does it look like in the place where he's going? It's a process that brought success. The 16-year-old is a twice-published author working on his third book. I did my first book when I was 14. His step into the literary world began two years ago while helping a family of stray cats. That journey inspired the book Saving Stripes, A Kitty's Story. It also opened the door to another venture. And it got, kind of got me thinking, there's a lot of teen writers out there. Justin wanted to provide those aspiring authors with an outlet, a free publishing company exclusive to teen authors. I feel very proud that I'm making a difference. With the help of his parents, Sigma's bookshelf took shape. So I was one of those kids who got the, you know, the no, you're never going to get your book published. And by golly, now I can help kids make it happen, you know, so it really, it's empowering for me too. The family keeps it no cost by offering their time and expertise. The design work happens in house and Rachel volunteers her time to copy edit each book. It's written by a 13 year old from Roseville. The company has published five books with more in the pipeline, allowing the youngest writers to have a chance to see their name in print. Rachel Slavic, WCCO 4 News. Sigma's bookshelf also covers the cost of registering a book with the help of grant money. If you're a teenager author hoping to learn more about the publishing company, we have the information on our website, WCCO.com.